I never tested the microphone when I probably should have. Hello, everyone. Know him. Kilt him. I'm excited to play Evil Knievel. How about you guys? Game Club Central, thank you for those gifted subs, but aren't you supposed to be somewhere tonight? Polish Ball, the uh, entrance warning is to cover my bases, because when it's hot like this, I can't be responsible for the dumb things that come out of my mouth. So if it shies some people away, I apologize, but be warned, I don't do well in heat. Well, that's not good. I'm hoping it's just this scene. We'll, uh, we'll figure that out when we get there. Well, Brad guy, I hope we don't uh, we don't break you tonight.
That's right, Arthur. I'm uh, not smog, but this is the Thursday throwdown. I forgot about the bug where the captive ball drops out of this table if you let it sit too long. So what you're hearing is the captive ball rolling back and forth at the bottom of the table. I'm gonna restart this table because that's annoying and maybe we can watch it happen live while I gab. Please wait. I am now loading up the game. Have fun. Hopefully my microphone sounds better. If it doesn't, I'm going to be super sad because I'm not sure what to do to reset it. All right. So I don't know if it's been fixed yet. I never noticed this until Manu's stream on Tuesday. But if you sit here with the table idle long enough, the captive ball will just roll out and then just sit and roll back and forth at the bottom of the table. And... Dang it. The microphone sounds funny or I'm muted. Eh, doesn't look like it's muted. I know. Okay. I sound fine. Thank you. I know Apophis has a fix for it, but pinned. All right. What is the pinned message? Paladin is in heat. Yes. I do not do well with heat. Um, and this table doesn't help because, so yesterday, uh, I missed the FX3 drain freeze tournament that really big hosted since game club is out. And when I came home, my son was down here just doing this. <laughs> the table's muted, isn't it? I'll get the hang of it eventually, I swear. No, it's not muted. So my dad was babysitting and he told him to come down here and do this 69 times. And then he was told to ask me why it was funny later. Anyway, I hope you are all having a good week. Um, Sorry, you're dealing with... My family is 10 out of 10. <laughs> uh, sometimes. Sometimes. Something like I... Something uh, I would do. Yeah, maybe. With help like that, yes. Uh, it was also... We got home, I don't know, probably about 11 o'clock last night. Uh, kids had uh, summer school this morning. And as I pull in... I see all the, like, I, I see the lights in the hallway turn on. I see my kids run down the hallway and then the lights turn off. And I come in as like, the kids go down all, all right. And my dad's half asleep on the couch. He's like, yeah, they've been quiet all night. I'm like, what time did you send them to bed? And he's like, bed? It's the summer. this table uh is this table around the same as bbb big bang bar um when did break shop uh, break shot come out i'm not i mean yes because capcom wasn't doing pinball for that ver for a very long time so i mean it's between 91 and 95 uh 
I want to say break shot was before Big Bang Bar, but I'm not positive. Spoken like a true grandparent. It's true. Elagos, hello. It is a proper childhood. I I survived him so they can do just fine. 96. Okay, so I was off by a year, but I'm pretty sure Capcom was out of pinball by 97, 98. Feel free to correct me, because I'm just guessing, and my memory is terrible. There's Ooh, a cry right. across the heartland, a yearning for the days gone by. And in little old court in Indiana, they're happy and they'll tell you why. They got butt drugs, they love butt drugs, ba 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 butt drugs, ba 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 butt drugs. Butt drugs. I recommend Ooh, butt drugs. Yeah. I can always count on butt drugs. When I think drugs, I think butt drugs. For all my health needs, I turn to butt drugs. You want hometown service and cheap hot coffee and liquor. Now that's the ticket. You can tell Walmart, CVS, and Walgreens exactly where to stick it. Ba -ba -ba -butt drugs. We love butt drugs. Ba -ba -ba -butt, drugs. butt drugs won't let you down. Free parking in the rear. I love butt drugs. I love butt drugs. Uh, That's better. That was the ooh is what I wanted. I was trying. I was dropping credits during the table, and then it occurred to me that the redeem mutes the table audio, so you guys weren't hearing it. It made me a little bit sad. It was well timed. Almost as much as. Uranus fudge. I mean, sure. <laughs> All right. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed playing Break Shot this week, and I hope you're excited to play Evil Knievel. I mean, whatever table Marty has chosen for this week. She went to butt drugs. Yep. <laughs> All right. I will promise I'm going to stop getting distracted. Uh, Marty Game Club Central has pre prepared a nice recap uh, scoreboard for Break Shot. And then let's see what we're playing next week, shall we? Button, button. This is a new show. Uh, Snoochie boochie noochies. Snoogans and salutations. I found it. Lasserte ich es anders durchgehen zu mir, nicht nur vier. Lasserte bleibe sechs. Warte.
you did guess it, Shell Schlock, and uh, I thought really, really hard about making a fake Evil Knievel video just to mess with Game Club, but uh, I decided to stick to the plan. And yes, I agree, Mr. Pendragon. Marty put together an epic trailer for this competition. And I'll be honest and say that I have never played this table. So this is going to be a learning experience for me. I wish I had some tips and tricks for you. But I do not. But I do have a working broken scoreboard. So the link has been updated. You can download the uh, table via the link in chat. But until someone posts a score, my scoreboard is still showing the break shot scores. So that's why I say it's a updated broken scoreboard. But let's fix that. For today and today only, you can replace CPO on this scoreboard just by posting a score. Any score will do. Let's play some Earthshaker. Please let me know how the table audio is in chat. It sounds a little low to me, but that's not always your experience. Polish Ball, I didn't know you had an Earthshaker. I might have to come compare. There's a trust post. I didn't realize it was there. Not sure I would have trusted it had I realized it was there, but it probably would have saved me. Repeat the Miles ramp if you want to exploit the game. All right, let me look which one is the Miles ramp. Is it the center ramp? Ramp spots next zone. Middle, okay. See, Polish Ball has this figured out. We should just follow him. Not me. Really? You can backhand it? I'm gonna try this. <laughs> I don't want to post this score, but I want to reset the scoreboard, so I'm gonna post this score. So if this is your first time here and you're unfamiliar with how this goes, uh, play a game. You can download the table from the link posted in chat. Take a picture of your score. Visit our competition page that you can find here. Click the submit a score button. It'll take you over to I scored. You put your score in along with that picture. And you'll end up on the scoreboard. Much like who's nine or whose line, this is all made up and the points don't matter. just casual, cool, friendly competition. Scoreboard takes about 30 seconds to update. Meatball Saucy, thank you so much for the follow. VPW absolutely crushed it with this table. Now, if I can crush a score, that would be great, but I don't think that's going to happen. 420 inside job. How's it going? All right, so the game plan as per Polish Ball is we're just gonna go for that middle ramp all night long. Oh, you know what? He said I could backhand it. Let's see. I will get this owned in. It'll probably be after the stream's over, but we'll figure it out. Two. 
Ha, ha. All right, backhand confirmed. A little bit of momentum helped. How does the website know whose score is whose? Um, you put your name in with your score and your picture. If you don't, or if you replace one, which don't do that, but it should, should update the website with the score just like that. Complete zones as in hit the lit numbers. It is meant to complete the zones, then go up the right ramp to lock. Yes, Mr. Pendragon. So when you click the submit score button, it'll take you uh, to an, it'll open a new page and it'll have name and score. If it's your first score, just tap anywhere on the page. It'll pop up with the window. You put name score and then there's an add photo button. If you're updating your existing score, you can tap your existing score. It'll say, hey, you, you sure this is you? It'll also prevent you from accidentally putting in a lower score, or at least it'll warn you if you're about to. And if you're having any issues, you can ask in our Discord, and we're so happy to help you out. So you're telling me there's a chance. There's always a chance. Yeah! Well, at least the score went up. Not great, but we're going up. Shellslock, thank you for summoning the Dragon Zord. Trying to see that picture. All right, for real, let's do it this time. Well, we're not playing barbed wire. You're you're not wrong. That would have been another one to do for fun too as a joke. I like barbed wire, but we just played it on special one lit. Excuse me, man. Depends, Mr. Pendragon. Do you want to know the truth or my usual lie? See, if this were the uh, non-mature stream, when it's not hot, I would tell you that I'm drinking coffee and Diet Coke. But the truth is, it's Copenhagen. <laughs> because I don't care today. Because. I'm here with the winner, Derek Lewis. Derek, why'd you take your pants off? My balls were hot. My balls were hot. I forgot. Alright, I think Polish Ball's onto it. His strategy seems to be working better than my last one.
He's a real man? I, I don't know about that. But, uh, and I lied. It's not actually Copenhagen. It is Grizzly tonight, because why not? What is not a lie, though? I'm here with the winner, Derek Lewis. Derek, why'd you take your pants off? My balls are hot. I understand. I forgot. Thought it was booze. I mean, I'm here you for know, that too. It's funny. What? You're a wiener. <laughs> also true. It's very funny. To alcohol, the cause of and solution to all of life's problems. in your general direction. I probably deserve that. Oh, that came quick. Bye-bye, oh, ball. That is what she said. One zone from lighting lock for multi-ball. All right, I see. Is it the one because it's blue? I guess what? I see. Oh, oh, hey, we got look. balls. Look at all these balls. Balls, balls, balls. Copy. All right. This is making you want to go play Pink Floyd? Okay. They blink when you light them. Got it. Post. Need to remember there's a post. We are slowly inching up. While I'm waiting for this score to post, has anyone else played? Trust the post? Yes. Uh, so, Gramps, there is a trust post or a... Uh, safety posts between the flippers and I keep forgetting it's there so I do things I shouldn't do in an attempt to save the ball and then when it bounces off that post when it would come back and go to a flipper I'm blocking it by having the flipper bat up so if I if I'm yelling about trusting the post Ooh, yeah. that's that's why I'm frustrating myself because I'm not familiar with this table everybody here is helping me learn it I see Marty posted a 2 million point score already. Let's see if we... I might have already squeaked past it. We'll find out in a minute. Oh, just barely squeaked by Marty. It's sunny drive time. Still installing. This is a big table file, if I recall, too. I, I downloaded it about an hour before we started tonight, and VP Universe took quite a while to fetch the file. I think it was like a 300 meg table. Fall the numbers, hit the hole in the in ramp. Uh, I'm showing green, but what kind of issues are you seeing, Pingizmo? We're gonna forget this game happened. I'm posting this to remind you about the post. Thank you, Lynn.
Thank you, Agent K. Uh, Don't ladies and erase you will, the... look right here. Oh, yes. You can erase the game. I thought you were erasing the message about the post. I need that. All right, it's time for some ball three voodoo. Do not trust the post. Is that like reverse psychology shell schlock? Hey, I got a courtesy match. I should play poorly more often. Trust the post until you can't trust the post. I mean, trust but verify? is a pity match, yes. Gramps, I love the voice sample you left for me. Ooh. Is that an open call, Mr. J? Can we all leave you messages? For the PBR table, but you uh, you can do one. Hmm. I'm more of a quarters light person, but I mean, if Patrick Swayze can learn to love it, they gave it a blue ribbon. Where's the ball going to come from? That was not nearly as bad as I was expecting. Enjoy, Meatball. Flares got me all hot and bothered. Need to calm down. Gramps says, it's all I drank before I was old enough to drink. <laughs> eh, fair. It was uh, what I drank when I was in my first apartment because it was what I could afford. That and Bud Ice, which I don't even know if they make Bud Ice anymore. And I do not recommend it. Hollywood Polo, how was your night going and what did you have for supper? I made tacos, Hollywood, and they were most excellent. My night is going very well. I hope your night is going well, too. What did you have for supper, Hollywood?
PB and J. Nothing wrong with PB and J. Did you cut the crust off? Not this time. Ball one locked. Final. It's okay. We got an extra ball. Pretty sure. Is your hurt arm able as well as it could flip before injury? Uh, no, Shellshlock. Uh, but I would say my play has gone down since my first hand surgery in... Man, was it 2022? 2023? Pretty much when I uh, gave up on playing in tournaments. <laughs> But it doesn't make it any less fun. But no, my response time and feeling is nowhere near what it used to be. Right, two balls locked. Does that mean I'm about to start the multi ball? There we go. I'm assuming I assumed it was if I locked two, but I didn't know if I had to do something else to start it. Straight to the L1 position. I see what I need to do, but I need to get control or double drain. Not a courtesy match. But we're doing better. Let me get the score posted and then we'll check in and see if anybody else has posted a score. Keep in mind, you have all the way until next week, Thursday at 2 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time to post a score. So if you don't get to it tonight, you got time. See what we got. I see a Grammy. At least I think it's Grammy. I don't have my glasses on and I didn't turn the tablet close enough. But it sure looks like Grammy.
Oh, that's coming back fast. Ha! Ah. Trusted the post that time. And I really want that four. Oh no, did Game Club Central pass me and I missed it? We had the evil grin. Close, but not quite. Unless the scoreboard magically updates here in a moment. Scoreboard should update about every 30 seconds. Oh, tr congrats for trusting the post. Get back up there. You work for me, ramp. know a friend of mine did call outs for this table i did not know do i know this friend the man himself mark ritchie that was going to be my guess it's okay we got another one the lock will stay lit I'll get my ball back. It's okay. it cannot get the hang of that upper left flipper i'm always too early or too late Should have trusted the post. Just shot 1.9 mil in two games. 8.5. Holy cow, meatball. not the five I was looking for. Come on, give me the five. Oh, I, I almost overshot the saucer there.
Yes, Gramps, please come to Pinball Expo. And I'm not just saying that because we need a designated driver. Oh, we definitely do need a designated driver, but that's not why I want Gramps to come. It's to lure the chicks away from us so we can keep playing pinball. question is, are we going to do Pinball Olympics? talk to my wife about pinball olympics this week i have a feeling that she's gonna say no even though i know she really wants to do it but she's gonna be volunteering for uh women's tournaments as a scorekeeper and she's gonna have a pretty tight schedule so i'm hoping she'll just tell me it's okay that i go without but i have to at least discuss it first And Mr. J, uh, and those who are going, don't forget, check the program when they give they give you a check-in. Uh, I'm assuming they're going to run the virtual FX tournament again this year. My, my hope is to win another one of these, but I would love to see some of you play with us. And yes, it's been almost a year and I still haven't hung it up. Consecutive post passes on Shrek needs to be an event if you do it. So if you are, if you guys are assuming they run the virtual tournament the same way they did last year, if you don't start on day one, you won't get enough points to make it into first and second you got a chance at third but you really got to play all the days consecutive because you can't make up the points you missed by not playing like it's better to play and come in last than to not play for the virtual tournament So for the or for virtual tournament or pinball Olympics for the virtual tournament, it is last year it was FX three. I don't know if it'll be FX or FX three this year. And it was played with a controller. You were allowed to sit down and you had to play. Um, you got to play through your you had to post three scores every day on random tables that they selected and you got two practice games before your actual attempt. For those interested in the Pinball Olympics, if you go to YouTube and Google or and search for Pinball Olympics, that is an event that is actually separate from Expo that takes place at the same time. It's a guy's house who has an amazing collection and he modifies all the games uh, to do silly things like he might reverse flippers. Uh, there was one where you stand on a merry-go-round and you're playing a table while the merry-go-round is spinning in the front yard and you 
get a card, you go through, you do all of your scores, you enter them in, you turn them in, and at the end of the day, he gives away gold medals uh, for the finalists. It's a good time. There's, uh, there's a, you buy your tickets from Pinball Life for it, and there is a shuttle bus that you can pay extra for that they will shuttle you from the expo center or from the event center uh, to the guy's house. A uh, lot of people do it, and it's a lot of fun. I'm sorry, Pin Gizmo. Did I miss Earth? Uh, Earth Shaker hangs on starting game scripts ideas. Um, that was gonna be. Uh, it continued after a long time. That was gonna be my guess as well. Um, Pin Gizmo is that you might need to update the pin name and the scripts associated uh, that come with the 10.6 installer. If you're using Baller installer, the auto update sh or auto updater should take care of you. And don't forget, if you're manually installing it, when you copy in the new V pin name, you do have to click the setup executable and then click the install button so it registers it. It's not really so much a true install as it updates the registry entries. Time to get serious. I'm going downhill quick. Oh, that ball! That ball just avoided that lock like it was a pothole. There we go. Gentle nudge. I was like, you better not go to that out lane. the six be ball and saucy have a good night thanks for dropping by and playing alongside us many balls, man. think I could backhand the lock. That was stupid. I should just let it hit the post. Good 
Your farts are nuclear tonight. Did you have tacos too? I had tacos. The Bacon King. I assume that's a, uh, a Burger King creation. I want to lock a ball and I want that extra get in there. Nope. Damn it. You purchased it from the King of Burgers. Uh oh. Show me the score again. Got it. I love the Bacon King burger, but they don't make the they don't make me fart. Thank goodness. Holy Grammy. Gremmy has leaped ahead by leaps and bounds. Did I get that score? I'm working my way up, but I'm no Gremmy. When are you coming to one of my tournaments? Uh, I'm not sure, Astro. I'm thinking possibly august the biggest problem with august is i'm guessing it's probably going to be around like the 24th which is also when my kids start school so it's going to depend on my wife's um, schedule july is not out of the question but i am waiting to see when i have to go to chicago i re really intended to make the one in may and then i got hurt and uh I still thought about coming and I was like, I, if I can't stream for two hours, there's no way I'm going to play in a tournament. It's sunny drive time. But I did play in league last night for the first time in like a year. I've been going to RLM tournaments periodically, not since I got hurt, but last night was my wife and I's anniversary and she asked me to go to league with her. And uh, I was... I surprised myself. I actually won my group and it was the last night of league final start next week. And uh, I'm like the third alternate if people drop out from one night of play. <laughs> but I very much want to make it out to the uh, pinball basement in Arlington, if for nothing else, to put the grand champion on Ultraman. That's my goal. Not saying I could do it, but that's my goal. Ultraman is gone. Don't tell me that. Kick that shit box out. Uh, I. I really like Ultraman. I, I realize there's a lot of very good reasons to get rid of it, but I actually really like that game. But most of it is the video package and the theme. Placed it with Munster's Premium. That's a that is a fair upgrade. I would uh I would do that. Hey, I got a courtesy match. I did that poorly. Game felt bad for me. It's sunny drive time. My partner didn't even want me to set it up in his basement. Ultraman is sitting in the corner on its back. Does that mean the Ultraman is for sale? I, I may message you offline. No. 
Nope, because he'd lose like 7k on it. Yep. Almost every pinball show I go to, there's always at least one distributor that has an Ultraman set up. And they're like, you know, take it home special, you know, 6k out the door. And I ponder it and I'm like, it's going to break in all of like two weeks. It's going to cause me heartache and then I'm never going to get my money back from it. But I don't know if I would sell it, honestly, because I actually really like it. I know. I, I'm not ignorant to the problems with uh, Ultraman, Halloween, and Rick and Morty, which makes me sad because I really, really like them. funny is I know a few people with Scooby-Doo's and I know they work on their Scooby-Doo's a lot but I haven't heard of uh, a lot of break issues with Scooby-Doo's at least not locally from people I know have them I'm curious if they're slightly better or if people just love Scooby-Doo enough that they're willing to put up with it Estimated value, 590. Yeah, that's kind of what I expect. I, It's funny is you'd think, like, I got to believe there were more Halloweens produced than Ultraman. So you'd think that if the Ultraman is the more rare, it would probably go for more. But that does not seem to be the case. I'll put up with a lot of shit for a Snooby Scooby snack. Exactly. All right, I'm going to lose some. I mean, not that I have a lot of, you know, pinball respect, but uh, I got to play. One of my dream themes is uh, Thunderbirds. I realize the existing Thunderbirds table is crap and I don't want to own one, but I did really, really want to play one because I love Thunderbirds as a property. Like it's one of my all time favorite shows as a kid. Um, just thought it was cool. I got to play one when I was in Vegas and I probably put like six bucks in that thing and it was it was almost a sad experience, but I kept playing it because it's Thunderbird. So yeah, I'm, I'm that guy. I will, I will play a bad table for theme just because I, did I start a two player game? Damn it. Did you spell international rescue? No, because, uh, um, the ramp was broken. <laughs> <laughs> it's sunny drive time. Yep. I do wish I was better at art because I would love to do an original Thunderbirds VPX. And who was the person that did the uh, the fireball table, the fireball uh, um, fireball fifteen, the other marionette show by the same guy? Why can't I think of his name? I loved what he did with the um, back glass and the like animated GIF um, background stuff. I thought that was great. You'll work on Thunderbirds with me, Mr. J. Table loads and plays fine eventually. Just sits fine for a minute when starting game strips. It's like a timeout going on. Um, have you tried just 
making sure your game scripts are up to date, like grabbing the latest release and just copying the scripts over. Anyone else watching The Notebook with their 13-year-old daughter this evening? What's that? Everyone? Great. Is not the post I was looking for. Sisterhood of the Traveling Pants. What about uh, the Britney Spears movie? What was it? Uh, Crossroads? Cross something. Unfortunately, those, uh, those uber chick flicks, I have successfully avoided most of those. I've been fairly lucky. My children are all boys. Not that that necessarily dictates their choice in movies, but it hasn't come up. They've been mostly on the action side. My wife is more of a tomboy. Our, uh, our first date, I met her because she was swearing so loudly at a pinball machine. It was a diner um, at Michigan State, like the table diner. She was swearing so loudly at it that everybody got quiet because they thought she was in trouble. And our second date, we watched The Killer, like the John Woo movie. And my third date, uh, I proposed. It's a double feature for me. She picked text starring young Matt Dillon to get started. Is it going to be a uh, stepmom next weekend or beaches? double check but i don't think that beats my high let's look at scores real quick i'd be down for beaches <laughs> she read the outsiders for school watched the movie and got obsessed with it you know i have never watched the movie I read the book in middle school or high school. I don't recall which, but I never watched the movie. Brat pack adjacent. My kids have never seen The Breakfast Club, but my uh, middle child is going through a vinyl phase and I gave him all of my old 45s and I had uh, the, the two albums or two records that get the most play. Uh, Axel F from the Beverly Hills Cop soundtrack and The Breakfast Club, the Don't You Forget About Me, nonstop. Yet, he's never wanted to watch either of the movies. He just likes the music. 
But that song is very much becoming a bad word in my house. Not Axelaf. It, it takes a lot for me to get upset about the Beverly Hills Cop theme. Over the edge. I don't remember over the edge. When I saw Edge, I was thinking, what was it? The the figure skater movie? Uh, the Cutting Edge? the hole That sucked. Okay, I think I'm just allergic to the scoop at this point. This is probably going to be my last game. I'm hoping on ball three here we get that extra ball and it keeps going. But I think we're going to wrap it up pretty quick. Uh, I believe... Get wow. That went terribly. That was a no-touch. Uh, I believe Game Club Central is streaming on Friday night. If he does not, I will do a Pinball M tournament or you suck at parking, one of the two. But I'll wait and see if Marty has something planned. I know Saturday night, I believe, is the premiere of the Born Identity Table from Super Tilted. That'll be over at Game Club Central. Sunday, we'll have the next special one lit. Uh, special one lit is the VPX tournament I usually run that goes Sunday to Sunday. This week, we're playing Hook information is at the same spot and i believe it's mike pcs yeah with that 568 on hook it's a hell of a score that is so much left ramp on hook All right, well, this is where I leave everybody. We are going to go visit RLM Amusements for their Thursday night tournament. My wife is playing there. Hopefully, she, hopefully she's in finals. Uh, our raid call tonight is going to be, Stacy, please bring tacos. I hope everybody has a good night. And this has been the Thursday Throwdown. Have a good one.